All right. Come on, you two. I know it seems like we've been walking forever. And that's because we have. We just got to find a spot where that damn radio can get a signal. It's our only hope of getting off this island. I'm sure you all are just as lost as I am. But at least we know we're somewhere within the radio signal. As long as we're getting static, it means there's something. It's weak. But the more we wander, the better chance we have of hitting a clear spot. So just keep your eyes peeled and your ears open for anything. The radio, predators, you know the drill. We're not exactly in some regular jungle. We're not worried about pumas anymore. Much more dangerous creatures in this place. My, my, this uh, backpack is uh, really proven to be uh, an, an issue. You're the one who took it from me. Huh? You said I shouldn't have it, that I'm bad with electronics. You walked yourself into this one, Malcolm. Let me tell you, John, I'd uh, much rather be in this kind of pain at the moment than um, with a broken radio and no hope of getting off of this island. Uh, uh, sir, I'm hearing something. This is Brickbird. Uh, the radio, the radio's going off. What? Is anyone coffee? This might be our chance. We got your signal a while ago, but you went dark. Come in. I repeat, ground team, come in. Hello. Hello. This is Operator Elliot. I'm on the ground and I have survivors with me. I repeat, there are survivors on Isla Nublar. As of now, I have Dr. Alan Grant and Dr. Ian Malcolm with me. But there are others lost on the island. I repeat, we have others lost on the island split up from us. John Hammond, Robert Muldoon, and Ellie Sattler are still unaccounted for on the island. I repeat, Ellie Sattler, Robert Muldoon, John Hammond. Thank God you came in. We have a chopper rendezvous to the island now. He'll be there shortly. But we don't have time to make multiple stops. It's too dangerous down there and the storm is approaching. We're going to need to get you all in one go. So make sure you can link up. Well, Hammond, the radio is officially busted. We have no contact with anyone. We don't even know if other people are still alive. Alan's alive. I just know he is. He has to be out there somewhere. No one's giving up hope yet. Just another damn hurdle in our way. That's all. Now, Elliot is one of our elite guards. Ex-special forces, in fact. He will keep the others secure. No doubt about it. Anyone can survive this island. It is Elliot. I have full trust in the man. He will bring Grant and Malcolm to us back safely. I thought the same thing. I thought I knew the raptors in and out, and then now they're on top. We just gotta figure out a way off this island. Get back with our people. So, until then, I'm just gonna keep tankering with this damn radio. Come on. Triceratops, the sick one from earlier. That's nice, but remember, they're very territorial, so observe them from afar. Mr. S Miss Sattler! Mrs. Sattler, what are you doing? Get back in the Jeep! Triceratopses are not friendly. They are extremely territorial. What are you doing? Uh, now, do Miss Sattler, I the really creature. suggest you get back in the Jeep and do not approach it. It is unpredictable. She's leaving already. Ellie, would you? She's not would even you listening guys to be us. Quiet? You're gonna startle it. Damn.
recognize me, don't you? It's me, your friend. <laughs> Guys, guys, she's calming down. My God, Robert, do you see that? She's approaching it and it's calm. It's not even showing any signs of aggression. I can turn around in a moment. She's being an idiot. She needs to get back to the Jeep. What is she doing? She's not some Disney princess. Easy, easy. There you go, good girl. Just look at you, you're absolutely beautiful. Hey guys, are you seeing this? I never thought I'd get to see her up and about. I knew it, you do recognize me, don't you? You're just so gentle. Okay, okay, I miss you too. Miss Sutton, I highly advise you return to the Jeep at once. There is a Tyrannosaurus in the area. We need to go. Oh, no, 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 this is bad, this is bad.
seems to be leaving. So, that's good. Ali, are you all right? You did it! You did it! You got off your first Rex! I'm so proud of you! Pinch me. I can't believe I just saw that up close. I cannot believe we just got front row seats to that. <laughs> and you should consider yourself lucky, Mr. Muldoon. Not everyone gets front row seats to such a prehistoric classic rumble. Oh, what a clash. Right, yeah, classic. Now, let's get out of this hellhole. Does anyone copy? This is Operator Elliot on the ground. On Ireland. Ian, too, too. Get off the radio. Listen, we have, we're still alive out here. We're looking to regroup with you guys wherever you are. Do you copy? Robert, Mr. Hammond, Ellie Sattler, do you copy? It's them. <laughs> Okay, okay, I gotta go. Please don't forget me. Remember me. I'll be back to see you. Come on, Ellie. We made contact. The, yes. This is Robert Muldoon. We copy you loud and clear. What's going on? Rendezvous with us at these coordinates. We have an evacuation lined up. All we need to do is meet up and make it to the chopper and we're all off this island. Roger that. Relay the coordinates now. All right, just meet us at that location. Get there as fast as you can. We're moving on foot, but we'll reach there as soon as we can. We're gonna get off this island, okay? Ellie, Ellie, are you okay? Are you safe? Roger that, she is here and she's safe. Somehow. We got a lot to explain when we get back, but it's damn good to hear from you boys. We'll be meeting up with you as soon as we can. Head to that spot, we'll be doing the same. This is Robert Muldoon, out. Thank God for that town rescue. <laughs> what did I tell you, boys? Life uh, finds a way. We're not out of this yet. Let's not get too cocky just now. We still have to walk there. We need to move. Fit. I hear something. Something in the jungle. Real vague, Dr. Grant. Something's always in the jungle. Relax. We'll be all right. Guys, get this thing off of me! You're not gonna cut me that easy! I've been one of the big ones! I'm not dying to a little one like you! Guys! Something! Stick! Yeah! I've got you now! Guys! Not doing anything. Ah, yeah. Did that hurt? Ah, ah, ah. Oh. Ah. 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 Well, thanks for the uh, rescue, there, boys. Really came in handy. Rescue. I couldn't even reach my gun in time. That wasn't me. <clears throat> Who shot at it? Huh? I don't believe my eyes. Well, looks like, uh, the reports were false. We got reports that you were dead. Right. About that. My death was greatly exaggerated. Let me tell you, though. Surviving with one arm has not been easy. And quite frankly, gentlemen, I am over it. So, if you all are just about done getting mauled, <laughs> we can get the hell out of here. I overheard you guys on the radio with the escape and all. Thank God I was able to find you. I doubt I'd be able to get much off this island with uh, one working arm. You sure saved us back there. Damn good to see you, Arnold. Any of us humans on this island are damn good to see us, especially a friendly face like you. Yeah. Never did I think I'd be happy to see other people. Nevertheless, I'm not here to slow you guys down. Just consider me part of the group now. Don't worry about my arm. Been able to survive on my own for these last two days. I can make it to that sweet, right. sweet escape route. I see you still got your gun. 
Any ammo? Hardly, sadly. I used a lot of it to save Mr. Malcolm back there. Just a handful of bullets left. All right. I think I got a mag left. AKA, we can't go tangoing with anything big. We have to stick to the shadows. Maneuver there as sneakily as possible. No trouble. You hear me? <laughs> I don't believe anyone here was uh, trying to uh, piss off the local wildlife. No, but we gotta be even quieter now. The warmth of your comfy beds is so close, gentlemen, you can almost smell it. Let's just keep the grind on. We're almost out of this hellhole. Wait a minute, you can smell your bed? It's disgusting. I'm hearing a lot of commotion. You guys stay back. I'll investigate it. No doubt this is something dangerous. Some bloodthirsty creature, huh? Hopefully it's not a Rex or a Velociraptor. Whatever it is, it sounds mean. <laughs> Are those two rats screaming at each other? Whatever. Better get them the hell off our car. Hey, hey, everyone, hey. Ooh, ooh. Get the hell out the car! Oh! Ah! Human afoot! Human afoot! I'll shoot you! I'll shoot you! Huh? Just you, huh? Feeling brave? Suddenly you're outnumbered. Go on, piss off. We got work to do. Um, Elliot, that is a tour vehicle. Let me get on the radio. Muldoon, Muldoon, do you copy? This is Elliot once again. We've made it to the rendezvous point somehow faster than you. Must have been closer. Still on our way. Well, uh, <laughs> at least I don't gotta carry the pack anymore. Free. I almost smell it. All right, let's clean her up. Get this baby ready for our evacuation, huh? Call it Noah's Ark. It's about to get us the hell out of here. Instead of a flood, one hell of a rainstorm's coming through. Total monsoon. There's no way we'll be able to get off the island once it hits. So, let's get in the ark and hop on out of here. That, that, that splinter right on the track. How are we going to be able to drive it? Well, as you can see, the truck here is not exactly hooked up to the line. Meaning it's an unmodified Ford Explorer. Meaning, a regular Ford Explorer. This baby can drive. There. Okay. Go ahead, Alan. Try her on. All right. Here goes nothing. <laughs> ha ha! Success. We got the kitten purring again. All right, everyone. Blackbird, Blackbird, do you copy? Find an LZ now. 
We're linking up with the others as we speak. We got our moving vehicle working, and we'll be on our way to the LZ as fast as possible. See you soon. Copy that, operator. Keep them safe. Will do. All right, everyone. Load up into the Ford Explorer. We need to get moving. Any moment now, our friends will be joining us. I gave them our exact coordinates. <laughs> Make sure Fire. not to make any mistakes this time. <laughs> Ian! Damn it! We forgot something in the drugs! Keep your head down, Ian! Keep your head down, Ian! Fire in the brush! Crawl towards me! Hurry it up! Come on! Get into the jeep! No! I'll hold him off! Damn it! Followed me! I knew they were following me! Terribly sorry we're late, but we made it. Any room in the car for us? This one's out of gas. Of course there is. Just get moving into the car. Move it. Damn it. Raptors again. Massa, don't have the time. Come on, Mr. Malcolm. Let's go. You made it! Thank God! Yeah, and Ian made it too! Thank God for that! They're all upside down, blood rushing to my head. Come on, Mr. Hammond, we're almost there. Now, now, Elliot, my boy, how old are you? Tony, no need for that though. Come on! You have your whole life ahead of you. This nightmare, and I will ensure that I get my people out of this nightmare. You, you must secure their freedom and get them to the helicopter safely. An old man like me can't. Give me this. No, sir! I'm to protect you! That is over now. Consider yourself the protector now of them. Go on. I won't see another person killed because of my creation. Sir! You can't do this! I'm the boss. Go! I've lived a long life. It's only poetic that I've been killed by my creation. What in the hell is the old man doing? John! I don't know. What is he doing? John, come here! Come on! Wait! No, we can't leave him! Go on, you guys! Leave! Now! Come on, then! You can take on an old man like me! Come on! In World War II, you know! This is Blackbird! Blackbird, we are approaching the LZ as we speak! I repeat, this is Blackbird, we are approaching the LZ as we speak! Landing in about two minutes! Are you guys ready? I don't want to be stranded on this island with you! I know this pledgy predator is big enough to knock me out of the sky. Are you ready? Over. We are nearly there. We're driving as fast as we can. Just get to the LZ and you will see us. We'll be pulling up in the Jurassic Park tour vehicle. Kind of colorful. You won't miss it. Don't worry. We'll be there. Just be there. We're so sick of this island. I hear you. I hear you. I think you'll be sick of this place. It's beautiful. Well, aside from the creatures trying to kill you, <laughs> Be there shortly. Don't drag your feet. We're landing now. I repeat, we're landing at the LZ now. You boys better have the right coordinates. There won't be a second chance until after that storm pass. 
God, you guys will be living after that. We've landed! Put that damn pedal to the metal and get over here! Company. Big company. You boys better hurry! We're hurrying! We're going as fast as we can! The Ford Explorer is not exactly known for its speed, you know? It's kind of a mom car. We're almost there, though. Just hold out for us! We're being chased! <laughs> Swerve or something! Get it off of us! Ha! That's the dust! Nice driving, Grant! Better hurry it up! I, I see them after us, Grant. I know! I'm trying! <laughs> I saw you got starting up the engine. Hurry up! Haul your ass to this damn chopper so we can get the hell out of here. Don't even think. Just run to the top. Come on, Alden. He's got a little bit more to go. Oh, damn. Don't look at it. Just keep running. Come on. Everyone, violent, violent. Let's go. Let's go.
Yeah. Oh, God. Just when I thought the nightmare wouldn't end. Oh, thank God. <laughs> this helicopter feels beautiful. Ellie, take one look out the window before we leave. We won't ever be saying this again. Yeah, I'm definitely over it. But I am a little sad I'll be missing my dino friends. Sad? Sad? <laughs> After what we've been through, I could just reach out the window and tell those dinosaurs to piss off. Well, at least I know they'll be all right without us here. Possibly even better. Of course they made it. They don't need our help anymore. <laughs>